What's going on, Throne Army? Joe here, and today I'm showing you some custom setups for Chad Wiedemeyer, an absolute beast of defenseman, played at Princeton, is now a proud member of the Boston Cannons in the MLL, and uh, he's a Maverick athlete, and he absolutely loves the tactic head and the way we string it up for him. Uh, of course, he's getting his signature CW45 pocket, which we'll get to in a second. Uh, this is probably the cleanest one of the three. Um, he also only uses our fiber system, absolutely loves it, and his favorite color is red, so he's trying to throw some red in there for the Cannons, and also just because he likes it. Uh, it's got the ruby colorway into it with that red stripe and then we got diamond going all the way around in the white. Same thing with the shooter setup with a little bit of gold and a thrown ball stop. Uh, this is, again this is definitely the clean colorway. Absolutely amazing looking with just that red stripe in it with the all white. In terms of the pocket, the CW45 is great for a ball handling defenseman or LSM. It's going to give you a, a nice mid that's channeled but not overly defined, allowing the ball um, to shift a little bit higher to give you a little bit better clearing potential. And then also if you're operating traffic with one hand, uh, the ball is able to sit down in the throat just a little bit but not get too stuck for that nice clean release you're looking for. He does some pretty good clears and also um, some pretty powerful cross clearing um, while also trying to operate in traffic. So we try to give him a high hold stick with a nice clean whip to it. That's a little bit on the adjustable side in case he needs to throw a little bit farther. The pocket will shift up and coming off those shooters will give him a little bit more hook, a little bit more power to be able to throw um, balls uh, a little bit more on the line as opposed to doing a nice big arc to it. Uh, but that's about it. We've been stringing this up for about a year like this for him. Absolutely loves it. And uh, this is the clean colorway. Next up is the pop of red colorway. It's got the same pocket, same mesh, same stringing. The only thing different is the head die. Um, this has got a new thing that I've been doing lately that I really like, which is doing a solid color, but actually it has a fade and kind of the hue. So up top we kind of have a normal red and then it goes down to more of a dark scarlet red, which gives a, a really cool look, almost like it's kind of fading. And also here we ghosted in Throne, uh, which I think goes really well with kind of all the Maverick stuff on it. Not too flashy, just a little bit in there and looks great with the same mesh and pocket. I also like that one kind of looks like, you know, a home, the other one looks kind of an away colorway. So I think that's kind of a cool narrative to um, always He's doing like a main stick and a backup stick and uh, again he likes red so I think he's really gonna like this one. And the final one we did was a request from Chad and I believe this is a gift for someone and that is a USA themed colorway. Did the same head same pocket but it has a different colorway to it. It's got the diamond mesh in it, cobalt top, ruby side, cobalt in the throat and then but uh, we kept the white shooters. It's got the ball stop as well. Biggest thing about this is definitely going to be the die, kind of an OG thrown colorway to it with doing the marble into a faded solid. Uh, but this one we did something a little bit different. It's got the red marble up top, but instead of just marbling to where the fade was going to be, we actually marbled it all the way down to here and then did the royal over it. So the marble is actually in the fade and a little bit of solid as well. Uh, adding a little bit more depth, a little more texture and kind of a, a cool different look, a different look than uh, you normally see. Absolutely love the way that it turned out. And uh, I like that we did this one with just the diamond. It kind of, you know, it's got that kind of throwback look uh, for me from Throne, and the other one's a little bit more kind of clean and classy, uh, what we've been doing lately. The red one's still my favorite, but Chris absolutely loves this one. Those are the three Maverick tactics for Chad Wiedemeyer. If you guys want to know why he likes his head, mesh, and pocket, you can definitely check out the featured video we did on him. I'll put a link in the top right-hand corner and also in the description below. As always, let me know what you think about these three heads in the comments below. And if you did cool custom heads like this, be sure to throw the video a like and subscribe to Throne Lacrosse to not miss the next one. That's everything. Hope you enjoy it, and I'll see you on the field.